Hi guys, in this video, I'm going to show you how to upload the project to GitHub uh, using Cursor AI. Cursor AI is an AI driven code editor that helps you to write code more effectively and more efficiently. It is built on top of Visual Studio Code. Now first I need to open the Cursor AI tool and then I will open a project first. I will go to my D directory where I have already created a folder with name Jupyter. Uh, let me just add this folder here. Select a folder. A folder has been added. So it has multiple files in it like for instance sample underscore hr dot csv video game sales dot csv. Now what we'll do uh, we'll open a github account. So I will type github here and I'll just open my github account and I will create a new repository from here. So I will name this repository as demo project something like that demo project uh, okay and i'll make this repository as public and i will click create repository and uh, the repository has been created and this is the https link for this repository now what i will do i will open the uh, uh, cursor ai tool and i will go to the terminal and new terminal so first I need to make sure that uh, the git is installed. So let me just check the git whether it is installed in my system or not. I'll type a command git uh, dash dash version and I will press enter. Yes, it is installed. If it is not installed, you need to first in install the git. Okay. So the next step is to initialize a new repository. For that, I'll be using the command git init. Let me just copy and paste the command over here and I will press enter. Initialize empty git repository over here. Now after that, once this command is successfully executed, I need to establish a connection, a remote connection between my local repository to the git repository. For that, I'll be using this command. Over here, I need to provide the name of my repository, a complete link to my GitHub repository. For that, I'll just copy this link and I'll paste it over here. I'll use the command git remote. It is a remote connection add and this is the name of connection origin. And let me just copy and paste the command. Okay, fine. Absolutely. Okay, enter. It is done, a command is executed with no problem. The next step is to put all the files to the staging area. For that, you will be using the command git add space dot. So the dot means that you have to put all the files. So if you want to mention any specific file, you can also do that. But I want to put all the files in the staging area. So for that, I'll be using the dot uh, command just copy and paste and this is the command git add space dot now enter all the files are copied to the staging area in the in working copy of uh, lf will be replaced by the next time git touches it okay just leave the warning as it is now after that you will have to commit the changes with the message so the message I'm giving is the initial commit. You can give whatever you want. Let me just copy and paste. Enter. Three file changed. Fine. Now after that, what I need to do is just rename the current branch. So I want to rename the current branch to main. For that, I'll be using the command, this command. Uh, look, let me just go to my repository and the repository name is demo project. Let me just go to this. Now let me just change the name of my branch to main. Enter. Done. So after that I have to push the code to the main branch and I'll use this command. Just copy and paste it over here and enter. It is doing something all done. Now I'm going to look at my repository. Just go over here and look at the repository demo project. And you will see all the files 
in my repository and the message is initial commit and this is how you upload a project to to github using cursor ai i hope you have gone through the process at the end i would request you to please subscribe like and share thank you